Bots suck. They buy without you, they die without you, and they fly without you? Rhymes are hard. A while back on Reddit, a post was made saying you can get bots to follow your every command just by hitting your affirmative key after your main claim. But how true is this? It really doesn't seem true at all. First, we need to get a control group. This part was actually pretty difficult thanks to this one setting that didn't have any clear effect at first. It's called teamwork and is found in the bot profile file. All bots appear to have the same value of 75, but I don't know what this number really does. While this is set to zero, a bot obeys commands about 50% of the time. When it's on its default 75 value, it listens to them about 90% of the time. According to Bez, the bot's best friend, it was used in condition zero for bot missions, and he couldn't tell if it was used in CSGO. From what I've seen, it seems like it is, but its way of working is mysterious, and I'm not sure what the difference of it during offline competitive versus matchmaking is. Anyway, to make it easier to see differences, I'll set the bot teamwork to zero since it seemed to have about a 50-50 split. In this control test, when I told the bot to hold its position after the round has started, I got 49 out of 100 tries where it did follow what I said. For my first test, I did what I did in the control test, except now, instead of just saying hold your position, it says hold your position and then afterwards affirmative. I'll include demos in the description in case you don't trust my word, but for this trial I got 47 out of 100. It didn't seem like it did anything. If you don't think this is enough times, fair enough. You can do it for yourself. But after doing this multiple times, it always seemed to be around 50%. But then again, you shouldn't just trust my word. Do it yourself. My second test was something my friend asked me about. He thought if you shoot right after your command, you can get them to bow into submission. Again, it doesn't seem to be true. The last thing I wanted to test is if spamming a command line multiple times would do anything. It did, but not how you would think. I thought doing it over and over again could maybe override the default negative with a positive. Because the more you do it, there's more of a chance that at least one of them would be positive. But it actually worked the opposite way. Bots didn't seem to respond positively to commands until after you stopped. And this somehow made them less reliable. Hold this position. Cover this area. Affirmative. So in game, do not spam it multiple times. It really won't help you out. In conclusion, your best case is to just go simple and hope the bot is feeling nice. Only one guy left. Hold this position.